Go. Go. Um, we're out here on the um, creek again. Same creek that we showed you guys the muskrat trap. Um, again, we're we're just showing you guys some uh, demonstration because um, we won't have time to show you guys these videos uh, during the the trapping season. So oh, this is a beaver house, and um, we found the location. The beavers have been coming up here to uh, eat or something. Anyways, it's all wet already, so they were you, you just came up here. So we, we're gonna do a drowning set. So the length of water you need to drown your beaver is four feet. So we have a 30 pound anchor here. So we're gonna go down here. Ooh, it's deeper. Ooh. Okay. Four feet. And make sure you never you don't have any uh branches in the water or anything that's gonna prevent your trap from going down. So we have our uh, long spring foot trap here. And on our chain we have a slide lock. That you could get at your uh, trapping supply store. Um, so we're gonna insert it on your on your uh, wire. Make sure you have your slide lock the right way, so when it goes down, you can't come back up. And here we have our pole that we're gonna tie the other end of our wire on. So bring this up. Make sure your wire is uh, tight from your anchor. So we're gonna see here and tie it up. See, we have a bit too long here, but it's just demonstration, so we won't tie it up. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Um, okay, we gotta get our, need to get our wire, which is here, we have our lock, and the trap, so we're gonna set our trap. Um, when you put your trap in the water, you always want to have it, like, like that, because if you have your trap like this, you, you could step on this dog here and it unset, and you probably wouldn't catch a beaver. So you want your trap to be aligned like this, so he'll directly step on that pan. So you want to make sure you have a nice, uh, solid base. And make sure your trap's kind of underwater so he can't see it. And here we have our lure, beaver lure. This can attract your beaver from about a quarter mile away to a half a mile away. Um, we'll put some on this stick here. Whoop. And whoop. we'll just have it a bit over our trap. Put it up there so he'll sniff that from far and he'll come up here. And you want to kind of direct him in here. So put some uh, some uh, sticks from the dam. In the house, I mean. So any, uh, any dead sticks or anything. Maybe try not to use them as green ones because uh, they might come up and eat it or something. This one right here. Just a few sticks. Make it simple. And just make sure he's kind of aligned to it, that trap. He doesn't go around. So, 
that's our trap for today. Um, we'll be subscribing more videos on YouTube, so watch them all. Thanks.